my friends, Tack. Today we're going to take a look at the Cold Steel Raja 2. Welcome back, friends. Technical specs. Overall length, 14 inch. Blade length is a 6 inch. The weight is 13 ounces. Handle scales are grivery. Now this is the older version, so the steel is Oz 8. Now the blade is a kookery style with a full flat grind. The retail is about 150 I think, and you can usually find them for 110. Give you a couple close-ups. Here it is in the closed position. There's your pocket clip. And it's funny seeing it in the middle like that. But it makes sense because this thing is so freaking gigantic. A couple small pins going around. It is the triad lock, which are pretty darn strong and safe. Uh, there's your texturing right there. Uh, it's grivery. It's not bad for grivery since they did do that little texturing. But it could be a little bit better. Open it up for you. There's the big old blade. Look at that bad boy. I love the stone washing too. It looks very nice. Edge looks pretty good, feels sharp. It's got the wave feature. Now the one thing I do like about this is you have so many different hand positions. You can choke up, go in the normal position, scoot back, give it the old three finger action, you know? So you got a lot of options with this thing. Now the pocket clip is reversible, which is cool. Now check the bevel. The bevel's perfect. So there it is in the pocket. Boy, she sticks out a little bit, huh? Damn, hey, how you doing? How you doing? Let's check out that wave feature. Got to move my stuff out of the way. I don't want to hit my sidearm or nothing. Damn. Yeah, that works really well. Check the centering. Cool, centering's perfect too. Now we'll try the initial sharpness, see how this goes. I have a feeling it's going to do well. Oh man, yeah. You think it'd be odd using a big, whoa, a big folder like this, but it's not because it's used to fixed blades. So a lot of fixed blades we use are way bigger than this. Oh, the sun's coming out. How cool is that? Yeah, this thing's freaking pretty nasty sharp, actually. Now, I don't usually do this with folders, but I'm going to hack at this a little bit. This thing's pretty BA, so, oh, yeah. See how the old triad lock holds up. Wow, look at that. That was almost one shot, just holding on by a thread. Not bad. Let's check, sorry, don't see, don't look at the beer in my arm. But yeah, <laughs> oh, nothing, totally solid. Let's do a tiny bit more abuse. Oh, <laughs> never done this with a folder. I feel so bad. This thing's hacking right in, man. Damn. You know, I think you could really F somebody up with this. I'm giving it the three finger action too. And it's just like, it feels like a fixed blade. And she's biting in really nice. So what do I think about this thing? It's actually a lot cooler than what I thought it was gonna be. I know it's a big, badass looking blade, but I, I didn't think it'd even take that abuse, but those trad locks are very strong. And man, that thing bites like a mofo. You know, there's a couple things I'd upgrade, like handle texture or handle material, period. But the blade design is pretty nice. Oz8 ain't the best, but it's definitely adequate steel. And so, like I said, I, I like it more than I thought I was gonna. So I'd probably give it a 7 and 3 quarters. It's always good to see you guys. And until the next time we meet.